A busy Thanksgiving week concludes on Sunday afternoon as Illinois Chicago takes on the Kentucky Wildcats inside Rupp Arena. And now for more on the Flames, here's today's opposition research brought to you by HKC Roofing. The 12 win improvement combined with the return of the top six scores has fueled optimism for the Flames in 2018. Enough, in fact, that Illinois Chicago was tabbed as the third choice behind perennial power Oakland and last year's winner NKU in the ultra competitive Horizon League. The early returns show UIC at 2-2 two two with their most noticeable blemish, a double-digit setback to UK's last opponent, Fort Wayne. The Flames score and defend but are undersized and do not rebound well. Such was the case against the Mastodons as they grabbed seven fewer caroms and on the season show up with a minus three margin. The roster is laden with youth as three-fourths are freshmen or sophomores and Sunday will be this group's first road game of the season. The well-traveled Steve McLean pilots the UIC ship and is 24 and 46 during his three years. The fiery veteran has an extensive career on the sidelines and is best known for an eight-year run at Wyoming where he led the Cowboys to three NITs and an NCAA tournament. McLean's composite mark is 180 and 160 with distinguished assistant roles at Colorado and Indiana between his two head positions. His tenure in Chicago got off to a choppy start as the Flames Ended 15 and 16 at 5 and 25, but despite being the youngest team in the country per Ken Palm, improved to 17 wins and a CBI appearance last year. The Flames' top players, Dikembe Dixon, the 6'7 sophomore, returns from a torn ACL and, when healthy, has shown great promise. He was the Horizons' top freshman in 2016 and accelerated his game to 20 points per prior to last season's injury. On the year, he's averaging 14, including a season high of 26, the 21st time he's eclipsed 20 points in a game. Dixon is a 37% three-point shooter and connects on 73% of his free throws. Marcus Adi ponies up 12 points a game and is the team's second leading scorer while shooting a robust 55% from the floor. Adi does all of his damage off the bench and is a former three-star recruit who spurned Cincinnati for UIC. The 6'2 sophomore torched NKU last winter for a career-high 25 and is a 70% free throw shooter. He was also a high school teammate of current flame, Jordan Blunt. Ty Odiasi is the lone proven frontcourt scorer and is the flame's top rebounder at eight to go along with his nine points. The 6'9 senior has 85 career starts and was last season's Horizon League Defensive Player of the Year. He's UIC's top rim protector with 257 blocks and has shown significant improvement each year. For example, in 2015, he was a 43% free throw shooter, but now 90%. He's one of but two seniors on the roster. 6'4 sophomore Tarkus Ferguson leads UIC in assist at four a game and has started all 40 since arriving on campus. He contributes nine points a night, but has three 20-plus point games on his ledger with 25 a personal best. Ferguson was one of the Horizon's top freshmen a season ago and has seven career double-doubles. He's a below average 26% three-point shooter on the season. Blunt is a 6'8 sophomore that started the first four games after not playing a season ago. The Ireland native is in at four and five with a career high of seven points versus Delaware State earlier this month. Dominique Matthews' numbers have dipped a bit in his second full season as a starter. The 6'2 sophomore has seen his scoring decrease from 11 to 6, in large part due to just 22% three-point shooting on the season. He posted a bagel versus Fort Wayne, but has shown glimpses of being a reliable scorer before, i.e. six 20-plus point games on his ledger. Godwin Bowen will also see plenty of time in the backcourt. The 5'11 sophomore is one of two Canadians on the roster and averages nine points and three rebounds a game. Bowen registered a triple-double last December, the first in school history. Fast facts, the Flames have three NCAA tournament appearances with their most recent occurring in 2004. Former Illinois standout and 2005 Player of the Year, D. Brown is on the bench as an assistant and Kentucky will be the Flames' lone Power 5 opponent of the season. Famous alums, a pair of notable actors, Family Ties' Michael Gross and Justin Hartley from This Is Us, also one of the top journalists of his generation, CNN's Bernard Shaw.
It's the first ever meeting between the Flames and the Cats with tip on Sunday at 6 o'clock and UK Sports Network coverage beginning at 4.30. For Opposition Research, I'm Chris Labar.